the odontoid, like I said, we won't see one and two with the AP cervical, so we're going to do the odontoid. So it's going to be real similar to the AP. The patient's going to be in the same position. You're just going to change just slightly the way that you're... Um, This time, since we're turning down so small, we just need an A by 10. And I'm going to go ahead and put my marker on, and I know that I'm going to come down right to the end, so I'm just going to put my marker in to where I'm coming down. Now, the same thing with the um, occlusal plane and the mastoid tip. So you want it to be lined up straight perpendicular to the table. Okay, let's change my combination. Okay. Now, for this one, um, you're going to open the mouth and you're going to shoot right through the center of the mouth. And if you get a pretty odontoid, it's really pretty because that C2 has the odontoid process on it and it comes up through C1. C1 is kind of a ring, so it's sitting up there. I know you've seen them probably in clinic, but if you get a pretty one, a lot of times they can be fractured like in a whiplash or something. So, but if you get a pretty one, they show up really well through the mouth. And I, there are different, different techs will probably have their own way that they get the dental with the best. Some of them might angle, some of them might, you know, shoot a different way. So you're probably going to see different ways, but this is the way that we're going to. 